Hey everyone, Tyler Russell here. And now I've been doing a lot of these in a row, so I felt like doing more. 101 things God can't do. And, uh, just because I feel like saying it, it's my video, so I can do it. I'll read this again. It's because God can't do with these things that we can do all things through Christ who gives us the power. Now let's see, we are on number 12, and we start reading now. Number 12, God can't leave work unfinished. And it says in Philippians 1, 6, Being confident of this very thing, that he which had begun a good work in you will perform it until the day of Jesus Christ. Oh, what? Oh, now to tell you why I thought of it. Well, you know, I admit there's sometimes when I felt like, you know, like with a video game, or I can't find a walkthrough or the walkthrough is really long and I can't finish it, so I'm like, oh, why? And then, you know, you know, when you like are in a book or one of those adventure series or you're playing a game and you try to look up how to beat it and there's no way you can find it. Because it's not a popular game, so people won't do let's plays or walkthroughs on it. So you're like, how am I gonna beat it now? How am I gonna get the treasures and stuff? So it's kind of like, but in this case, God does finish things because you know He's God and He can do stuff like that. And yeah, that. So what did you think? You heard what I thought about number twelve. What did you think about number 12? God can't leave work unfinished. Uh, please place, put down what you thought of it in the comments below. I will be uh, putting this on Facebook later on as soon as I put the other ones on. And uh, Until then, uh, Merry Christmas, Happy Kwanzaa, and Happy Hanukkah. And I think we had winter solstice, so yeah. Have a happy that too. Bye-bye. Where are you going, Chloe?